we have RFID NFC module version. So in this case, you will see here there is five way joystick. Then you have status LEDs for power as well as tag scan. That is whenever card scan. So this LED indicate. Then 1.3 inch display for visual interaction and NFC module. So on the top side and on the back side, you have Pico W, then GPIO breakout on both side, then battery connection for portable use, SD card for data logging and buzzer for audio alert. So now we are on SB component side. Here we have open read pi. So you have two option read pi 125 kilohertz and read pi NFC which is 13.5 megahertz, 56 megahertz. So currently we want to focus on this NFC module. So all the details regarding board and product is available on the site. At the bottom side you will find the sources. So for both product available, we are interested in NFC. So click on this software GitHub and hardware GitHub. Hardware GitHub provides you design file related to board like schematic, circuit design and 3D files, etc. And on NFC software section, you will find getting started guide how to use this particular board. So if you scroll down, you will see pinout and interfacing detail of various components with Pico W is provided here. So which you can check out. So corresponding GPIO of Pico W used with different modules and components are shown and the functionality is also explained. So which you can use to program accordingly. And then you have step to install boot firmware. Basically you will be getting your board pre-installed boot firmware. So if in any case you need to again reinstall, then you can follow this step. Otherwise you can skip directly go to second step start experimenting with uh, example codes provided here. So different sections are available which shows you how to move script and how to run standalone code on your read pipe. So you can check out that. So in the example example section, there are so many examples provided which you can use for as a as a startup. So let's see. So what is recommended? You can directly download this complete GitHub from here. Already I have downloaded here. So you can see I'm currently into example folder. So why you need to download this? Because in document section, you will find two, you will find two files. One is command related file how you can send command and what expected response for a module you will get. So that you can check out, you can read this manual. And second document is provided uh, regarding NTAC 213. So how memory is mapped in NTAC 213 and which corresponding memory is available for read and write operation. So all those details are available on this particular document. So if you see here, in NFC module command manual, you will see various commands are available. So how to send and what response you get that is provided. For example, suppose you want to set baud rate. So what expected response you will get and what data you need to send. So this is what exactly to set 9600 bits per second. So you need to send in data 0x00 code. So similarly other, and if you see in the course section, there is a one library nfc.py, which is very important. It, it, it should be available into read by Pico W. So for example, right now let's connect our board. So once it is connected, so you can see uh, main.py, which is main script code and nfc.py, which is library file. So in library section, some of commands already provided like hardware version check and get address. So NTAC version. So you can call this particular function and experiment. So you can see and to read write 
like start byte or what should be end byte is also provided so you can add read that manual more commands if you are interested so let's try some code for example suppose demo display joystick so i just want to run without instead of transferring this code to here directly i just want to test so click on this run button so code is executed without changing that main.py so you can see so and if you if you want to make it a standalone run then you can transfer this code and that step is shown on github now let's try some nfc module demo so here what we are doing uh, data so suppose this kind of data you want to write and this is what baud rate so currently default baud rate is set to this 9600 and page number 15 what what is this page you can see so various memory section is available for write operation so this kind of section you can see user memory available so right now we are interested in writing data to 15th block okay so four bytes per page is required so you can see must be four bytes so so this command writes the data and we'll check if there is data so we can uh, if uh, write successful then we can read data of that particular page so let's say i just want to run this code so waiting for scan as you can see 147 and if i want to change this data so suppose 48 47 you can see data change and similarly you can use another nfc card this one key for form factor and if you are interested you can change clock also so it will write same data to that block and you can change so similarly you can modify so read that manual and modify as per your requirement so thank you so much